AppBoy provides multiple delivery options that will empower you to reach users at precisely the right time. In addition to scheduling campaigns to send at certain dates and times, you can set them to be triggered after users complete a specific action. When setting up an action-based schedule, first select what will enable users to qualify for your message. These actions can be making a purchase, opening the app, or any custom occurrence you choose. If you select making a purchase, you can also specify that users need to have purchased a specific product. For this campaign, let's target users who've abandoned their cart. If you wish, you can add multiple trigger actions. After your selections, you can add a schedule delay, which specifies how long to wait after the user completes the trigger action before sending the message. If you add a delay, you can also specify an exception event. If users complete the exception event during the delay time period, then they won't receive the message. Let's delay our message for 30 minutes after users abandon their carts and disqualify any users who end up making a purchase during that time. Next, you can set the campaign's duration and designate whether its start and end times should be in the user's local time zone. If a schedule delay prevents users from qualifying for the campaign during its duration, they won't receive the message even if they completed the trigger action during the specified period. You can also elect to send the campaign during a specific portion of the day if you don't want to send messages during certain times. Once again, if a user completes the trigger action during this time frame but due to the schedule delay doesn't qualify for the campaign until the time frame is passed, then that user won't receive the message. Lastly, you can allow users to become re-eligible to receive a campaign. This means that users who have received the message are able to re-qualify for it after completing the trigger action and necessary criteria. You can specify that the users can't re-trigger this campaign until a certain amount of time has lapsed, which will help prevent your message from appearing spammy. For instance, triggering a shopping cart reminder more than once in a two-week period. After you're done setting up your campaign schedule, go to the next step to target your message at a specific segment of users.